first we should know actually what is the accounting actually what do we mean by accounting so see here definition is given accounting is what an information system accounting is an information system and that identifies the first uh, uh, you know task in accounting is what identifying so accounting is, is an information system that identifies records and communicates economic events of an organization to the interested users so it, it means accounting include three things identifying transactions after identifying transaction we need to record the transactions and after recording transaction what we do whatever result we get that result we communicate to the owner of the business so we should understand all these three three elements identifying recording and communicating so what do we mean by actually identifying so see here clearly given here identifies means which business activity is to be recorded understood suppose i started a business suppose this is this is my business this is my b this is my business okay now in this business you know there will be lots of activities and which activity we should record and which, which activity we should ignore that we have to understand first so first task in accounting is what identifying identifying what identifying the activities which we need to record and identifying those activities which we need to ignore okay so let's take an example suppose i started a business okay and i appointed appointed an honest an honest worker or you can say employee get my point i started a business and i appointed an honest employee in the business but i can't record this event this is this activity i can't record because this activity you know doesn't have any economic value doesn't have any monetary value though we know that honest employee is really very fruitful for the business if we have honest employee if we have dedicated employees definitely our business will grow in the future now see the second transaction purchased furniture purchase furniture for cash dollar 5000 so now see the first activity we can't record but the second activity we can record because we brought furniture isn't it and we know we know the what is the value of the furniture the value of the furniture is dollar 5000 so the first activity we can't record but the second activity we need to record understood so like this we have to identify that which activity we need to ignore and which activity we need to record now see after identifying this after identifying this what we have to do we have to record the transaction get my point in the books of accounts recording business activities and to record you know business activities or business transaction there are certain rules and those rules we have to follow there are you know certain accounting principles and concepts so after identifying those activities what we will do we will record those activities and to record those activities what we what we have to do we have to follow accounting rules and we have to follow accounting principles and concepts so the first task is identifying activities which we need to record and after identifying what we will do we will record those transactions now after recording what is the third activity in the accounting we need to we need to communicate the result of the transactions the result of the records now let's take an example suppose i purchased goods purchased i purchased goods for you know 5 5000 dollar okay so this activity we will record isn't it because this is this activity has a monetary value now see after this now see the second activity i sold the entire goods for dollar 6000 i brought the goods and then i sold the goods the same whole goods i sold now tell me what is the result of the good? these are two transactions and both both has you know monetary value and both transaction we will record agree now see what is the result so we brought goods for 5000 and we sold the same goods for dollar you know 6000 so there is a profit of dollar 1000 isn't it now this is the result profit of dollar 1000 and this result we need to communicate to the owner accounting you know helps to communicate these results to the owner being a owner of course you want to know how much profit i earned how much loss is there in the business isn't it